all right guys these are the two projects i am working on currently and the tutorials of these two projects will be there in my future videos so this is uh, this is a, uh, a gta clone type of thing of course top down a 2d thing and uh, here you can see you can control this main guy the protagonist and you can see this arrow this arrow always points towards the target the place where you need to reach for example if you need to reach this uh, for example this orange square this orange square where this arrow is pointing towards it is my target so whenever it is on the screen the arrow will actually point towards that actually will run to that target and then point to the target but when it is off the screen the arrow will show me where the target is the direction of the target where i need to go and this is the uh, so this is what i have implemented and and uh, there are enemies these are my enemies and they uses line of sight so basically if see i came in the line of sight and they started firing at me they can only see me though they can only see me if i'm in front of them not when i'm back of them by the way guys i do not have any health system for my current player for my protagonist because well i do not want to die <laughs> that is why and uh, well let's get out of the range yeah i'm out of the range now you can see i'm the back of the enemy no problem see but if the enemy turns towards me then the problem will occur anyways i can shoot the enemy with the y z like it turned towards me and it's the problem or i can shoot my enemy with my z button and this is this is normal pedestrian this blue color guy also let me shoot another all right i accidentally shot it i actually accidentally shot down the pedestrian over there so no police system so no problem and this is the main thing main attraction this is the main thing main attraction of grand theft auto the car system the car i'll press f and go inside the car and yeah i'm in the car and this view actually uh, i i might probably change this thing like currently i'm doing this thing when i'm in the car that the screen rotates according to the direction where the car is facing but i might change this thing uh, if i feel that it is not proper all right also the next all right so this is it for this project and the next project i have been working on is a peggle type of game uh, this uses physics this is physics so the target of the game is to hit all these purple colored pegs this dark uh, colored other uh, these dark colored pegs all right i think it's purple i have really i have got really bad sense of color so all right so all the sounds i know you it is making you guys crazy right all right anyway so let's see this. as you can see when the ball continuously hit pegs the that hitting sound that the frequency of the hitting sound increases so this is a kind of feature i've added over here and you can see in the top left corner the score is being displayed and the number of balls i've left so initially it was 10 now i've got nine balls left and also if the ball hits the this bucket why kind of a bucket thing if it hits the bucket then 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 the, the ball will be saved that ball won't be won't get wasted all right so basically i get a free ball all right so let's see if i can complete this level also if you can see the scores is the scores are being displayed over here as soon as the peg gets destroyed the score is get, being displayed over here save that ball save that ball yeah also this this the dark colored balls where the dark colored ball will place is not predetermined it will be determined as soon as when the level starts it will be determined it randomly chooses 10 pegs out of all the pegs and they make those 10 pegs a dark colored peg so this just keeps a sense of randomness all right i win this level 
or right, as you can see the score for hitting peg is 890 and ball bonus the amount of balls I have left I think I had six balls left so that's 600 and the total score for this level is 1490 and the total score is 1490 if I uh, if I like say if I'm in level 2 and I have played the level 2 so this basically shows the score of this particular level and this shows the score of the total level like total I mean the all the levels I played the combined score alright so these are the two projects I've been working on and I will very soon do the tutorials of these two projects uh, so you can expect them in my future videos so thanks for watching you can hit the like button below um, thank you very much